Welcome back. If I ever told you I hate computers? I don't know why, but for some reason, just trying to start this up, um, my computer just randomly, for no discernible reason, decided it didn't want to work, and it crashed, and then the recording messed up, and I had to restart, and it wouldn't boot up, and things were happening, and oh, I don't even know. But anyway, this has been requested by both my darling girlfriend and my daughter so I couldn't very well not do it so without further ado here we go ah, I'll be playing I don't have undead nightmare so um, at some point I, I do plan on picking it up but yeah I'm starting a brand new game I want to delete it my old save files now I have actually played some of this already I played the whole game on the PlayStation 3. I've already played some of it on the, the Xbox and then I started getting into Let's Playing so I put it on hold and figured I'd start again from the beginning which is thinking about but I went and deleted the save file so instead of loading up a new game and why am I explaining all this? Let's just start the damn game. I know the game uses an auto save feature. Come on. Sheesh. Talk about stuff and things and things and stuffs. Has quite a lengthy intro sequence for those who don't know, and I am not going to skip it. I am going to let it all play out like it will want to be played with the things of the playing of the stuffs and things. Yeah, something like that. I know what I'm talking about. Do you know what I'm talking about? Good, because I honestly don't have the faintest idea. <sighs> I've been meaning to do this for a while. I've said that a lot lately, actually. I've been meaning to do this for a while, and I've been thinking a lot about it. I, so it does have some very mature content in it, but I couldn't decide for a long time whether it was a mature game or not. And after much deliberation, I've decided that overall, it's not really. I mean, not mature in the same way as something like Limbo, where it's thematic and tonal maturity. This has moments of that, where it's not consistently the whole way through. It's a bit more... It's a bit more spaghetti western. It's more mature teen sort of level than mature, mature sort of level, if that makes any sense. Yeah, I know what I mean. Anyway, the point is, I'm going to do it through the week as evidenced by the fact that this will be uploaded through the week. I, it's just, just go with it. Just go with it. You, you know what I'm saying and stuff and things. I don't know whether I'm going to have to um, fiddle with the settings after it finishes loading up or not. Because uh, I have the settings set to things and stuff. It looks right to me, because the way the default like, setup of the um, uh, color balance and stuff, it has everything kind of wishy-washy and washed out. I like to have a lot more uh, contrast than that, and it does look to be about where I want it to be, but then again, that could also be because of the way I set my TV up, because I have a lot of contrast on the TV as well. Mm. It's going to be a pretty long let's play. Because I'm going to do, like, all of it and stuff. Well, we're not getting, um, thingy-ma-jobs. What are those things called? Subtitles. I'm not getting subtitles. That suggests to me that, um, settings are the way they're supposed to be. Because I always turn subtitles off. I'm not entirely sure why. I mean, for, um, let's plays and stuff. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Because bigotry was is such a new invention, isn't it? Ugh, I hate people like that. Jesse Yerkes. What kind of name is that? that pretty soon we will be able to fly no <laughs> only angels can fly Jenny. you do meet all of these people no, no, on the way apparently people can fly didn't you hear out in kansas 
a man even got a car to fly. <laughs> yeah. I hardly think okay. so, Jenny. Kansas, huh? Apparently. Kansas City. Mr. Johns wants to run for governor, which is why he's so concerned with cleaning up the state. Nate At least, Johns I think you meet all of these people. Says family is nothing but hillbilly trash that came here after the war. I know I don't want to be some of them for certain. This state should not be ruled by such a disgusting family. Like the young family women's Jenny, is it? Without class. Apparently, the Johns family have made a lot of money. And the woman who was at the back as well, important. Bonnie McFarlane, she's one of the Mr. major characters. One of my favourites as well. There are many things that money cannot buy. It seems that money can buy voters, though. Yeah. To be honest, everything is for sale idea is that we have been for the right price. The word. And the word and civilization, they are the same thing. They are the gifts. Yeah, bunny. It the blonde the women's at the front. We have, the chance to live among people so why did you move to the front? And who do not kill each other. And who let you worship in peace. <sighs> Confusing, Father. Hmm. Sometimes I find it impossible to make the distinction between a loving act and a hateful one. I mean, they often seem to be the same thing. Yes, Jenny, it, it is confusing. Yeah, Jenny. But you only have to ask me. She has one of the interesting, well, more interesting are, side Mrs. quests. Bush, armadillo. Armadillo? Two armadillos? Uh, it's been a while since I've used a controller. Again, so expect me to be a little bit rusty. Man, look at that frame right. Isn't it awesome? Right, uh, let me just make sure. Yep, stuff and things. Uh, options. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, cool. No, no, not that one. Actually, yeah, I just want to have a quick check. Do I have the... Uh, like I said, I have... 250 headshots. Ah, yeah, I've already done that one. Good. We're number 2,000. Yep, yeah, 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 I have them. Place a hogtied woman on the train tracks and witness her death by train. That's... yeah. That's pretty messed up, that one. But I've already done it. Okay. Let's get on with this then. Let's go. Let's go. Get our done. Wait, can I open that? Nope. Honestly, never tried. Nope. Seems that like I can't. I'm probably going to go straight with the um, thingy bobs to begin with. No, not that one. That one. Yes, I do have the war horse. Good. And a basic campsite, which I like, never use. Uh, just trying to remember all of the buttons. <laughs> okay. Was that anything to do with me, or did he just fall on his own? But yeah, I'm going to follow the main missions until I get my um, lasso and stuff. Mm. Then I'm going to start doing a lot of side quests, so this is going to be a long one, because I'm going to do... As much of the side so stuff as I can. I'm Jake. Your friend from Blackwater hired me to guide you. All right, I think my watch him a bob is off. I got the horses saddled up and ready out front. No, fair enough. It's just really quiet. <laughs> Fairy dudes. Fairy zigzags. That is a purdy skybox. Alright, which button is it to get on horses again? Is it triangle? Uh, y. Yeah. Come on. Come on, dude. Let's go, dude. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Play 
his house get all freaked. Freaky deeked. Come on, dude. Yeah, now it's gone. I must have knocked it whilst I was trying to stuff the things. There we go. Okay. I've had it for like nine years, so it's a bit temperamental. Still working now. Just cables come loose from time to time. I've always loved the skybox in this game. I always thought the the vice actor for John Marston was the same as um, Marcus Phoenix, but it's not. Are you planning on spending any time in Armadillo, Mr. Marston? Yep. I doubt it. I ain't planning on staying very long. Well, if you're you might not be. I am. Female company, you can do a lot worse than Armadillo. Fine as cream gravy they are. Not like Steve's Landon. Cream Man, gravy? That was one thing I liked about this. I work with the um, uh, the Grand Theft Auto games. You can't use the prostitutes. Although, in some way, I think it would have been nice if they had let you be more realistic that way. I think I heard his name. But, you know, made a nice change. Trying to put some morality into the character um, right from the beginning. So to speak. Yeah. You ain't very talkative, are you? Nope. nope. I'm just chewing the dog, mister. It's how I am. I don't mean nothing by it. Trust me. There's things you better off not knowing. Yep. So. I'll tell you, Mr. Martin, those coyotes eat better than I do. Wolf or Not far now. You'll see the fort when you get to the top of this hill. Yeah. Look at carcasses. There it is. There we go. Listen, mister. This here is what's left of Fort Mercer. Some gang rode in and took the place over. Yep. So I understand. This is where we part ways, friend. You have yourself a good time. Oh, I will. <laughs> oh, I will. Yeah, now that I've finally got this bleeding game working. Right. Come on. Let's go get shot in the face. Or in the, the arm or whichever part of the body it is that you get shot in. Yeah, spoiler, that's what's about to happen. I'm about to get shot. And then I'll end up on the McFarlane wrench. For some reason. Still not understand exactly why. The McFarlane Ranch is ranch, ranch is like two miles that way. The way I was facing when I turned the camera a moment ago. Like I said, it's basically this is a still part of the intro, so yeah, quite a lengthy one. Didn't give Shen Miller room for its money. Bill Williamson. This first part's going to be a bit Come boring, to right be honest. Now. It's going to be mostly me. Jibber jabbering. Might upload the first you. two parts together. To kill anyone, Bill. Just so there's more happening. You must think I was born yesterday. Nope. You always did think I was an idiot. That's because you are an idiot. That ain't idiot. fair, Bill. You were as my brother. I've come to try to save you. <laughs> <laughs> What is it with those hats with the one part turned off anyway? Bill, please. They want to kill us all. I can help you. So, that's a Winchester, isn't it? I like Winchesters. Well, you never tried to save me before. You only seem to save yourself. Bill, I implore you think about this. <laughs> <laughs> You implore me? Yes, I implore you. <laughs> to be a nums. You implore me. Yep. 
You always were one for fancy words. What's wrong with a bit of book learning? Hmm? Things are different now, John. Now I'm in charge. Oh, really? No more Dutch. And no more you. Implored. I, I implore you to go back and tell them to send someone just a little bit more impressive next time. Don't do this. Well. Seriously, dude, what did you expect? Poor Jim. Oh, pleb. You lost your touch, old man. Well, not old, but you know what I mean. Hmm. So why are they doing all the way up there, anyway? I mean, seriously. Makes no sense to me. We're a long way from home. A long way from home. I like Bonnie, though. She's a great character. Most definitely one of my favourites. You friends, old problems. Hmm. We will actually get a chance to play something soon. Soon. And don't worry. I won't go and spend all my time playing Welcome poker. Alive. Just most of it. So it would seem. Yeah. So how do you feel? I'm one of them. I don't know the polite word for it. I do. Stupid is the word we use around here. What were you doing? I was... Oh, I was doing something stupid. Well, you'll be okay. Once you didn't die, the doctor said you'd be fine. He got the bullets out a couple days ago. Good. It cost us fifteen dollars. How much that is in? You left me there to die. Not an equivalent. Did you want to die? I mean, was that it? Was that why you went straight out to Fort Mercer and picked a fight with the worst bandit in the county to die, Mister? Er, Mister uh, Marston. John Marston. Bonnie McFarland. Miss Bonnie McFarland. Well, you may be right, Miss McFarland. I don't know. Huh. So what were you doing? Being Trying stupid. Mr. Williamson a chance. For old time's sake. You know Bill Williamson? Knew him. Long time ago. Well, what was he like? Dumb. Just like you. Yep, pretty much. See my hat? I have. Do you really expect uh, to wake up wearing it? Now I'm gonna take my time and go after him the less kind way. Well, that sounds very fun, Mr. Marston. Quite heroic, just like in those penny dreadfuls my brother used to read. <laughs> Meanwhile, if you'll excuse me, I've got a ranch to run. Of course, if you're feeling better, why not take a ride with me later and help me patrol the perimeter? You can earn back some of that money we wasted on doctor's bills. Sounds like a fun. Of course. And thank you for saving my life, I mean. Next time, Mr. Marston, I strongly recommend you don't try to lose it quite so earnestly. Yeah. That in mind. Well, I'm in control now, so I'm going to be able to decide what he does. Which means he won't go just wandering right up to the front door like a pleb. Right. Now then, finally... Like I said, it does take a lot of bits. <sighs> Forgot about that. Still part of the intro, pretty much. Don't even have my full costume yet. I have my gun. Yay! Now, which Wempus do I have? I have my Kniffage, and I have my Cattleman Revolver, and I have my Fush. Cool. Right. Let's go help Bonnie with whatever it is she needs me to help her with. Because, you know, do owe well her my life and stuff. I wonder if I'll see a jackalope blossom out here. So I have the, the DLC for that. 